All right, this man right here has released all the secret manufacturers and vendors that companies like Nike, Kylie Jenner, North Face, Supreme, Supreme, <laughs> all of those companies use. And he's gonna let us know some now that you can use for your brand. I'm gonna give you five minutes. Five? Yeah, I'm gonna give you five. five. And if you stick around to the end, he's gonna let us know of a way that you can find a manufacturer as well. Yep. My name is Rich, and this right here is Justin. You want to introduce yourself? Yeah, what's going on, everybody? My name is Justin P., co-founder of a business called Support by Colleges, and now we teach people how to get into the space as well. But I've learned a ton from this guy right here, so I can't wait to give some game to you guys as well. Let's go. This is a fire crib, by the way. Man, I appreciate it, brother. I had to interrupt. <laughs> All right, let's get to it. Well, the first manufacturer is one called Eurotex. Now, this is who Kim Kardashian uses for scams. So this is a big, big supplier out in Turkey, all right? So for anybody that wants to do like shapewear, uh, you know, fitness wear, things of that nature, they'll be great for you. That's crazy. Yep. Next up, you got one of my favorites. They're called Undash Available. So Undash Available, I'm actually on the brands that they do right now. So they do people like Justin Bieber's Drew brand. They do Stussy, Palace. They do Kendrick Lamar's brand. They do OVO. They do Kith, Golf Wang, and Mad Happy. So That's this one crazy. place does everybody's stuff, right? The third one is who I use personally in my business as well as a company called Boston Industries. Mm -hmm. So if you need track suits, jumpsuits, t-shirts, sweatshirts, sweatpants, everything top to bottom. For a new brand owner, they're gonna have really low minimum order quantities and they're super high quality. I've been working with them for like five years now. Fire. So then you got Rupa Knitting Mills. Now most people don't know, but this is who makes all the Supreme stuff. Ooh. So if you go over to their own blank site right here, House of Blanks, you can literally get the exact same quality that Supreme uses for all of the blanks that they sell. So I'm talking hoodies, t-shirts, everything that they sell, you can get the same quality. And last, but certainly not least, you got Create Fashion Brand. Now they do Off-White, Givenchy, they do a lot of the high-end luxury. So I wanted to give a good, you know, perspective from Super small MOQs all the way up to big MOQs, luxury brand as well. And get it all covered with just those five. So if you only need a few, this one, they can hit them up. Yeah, and the cool thing is Create Fashion Brand will even do private labeling. So you can literally just send your stuff to them and then they'll private label high quality garments for you. So they'll print your stuff on their high quality garments. But you know, it just depends on what type of brand you have. That's why I wanted to give a wide variety. This is more so luxury. You know, Rupa's more so for that streetwear, you know, Supreme style. Boston Industries is you're trying to get in the game with low MOQs. And then you have Unavailable. They're just gonna be a high quality, but not super luxury, but kind of right in that, you know, Kith, Off-White, or excuse me, Kith and October's very own type of vibe. And then it's just for others that wanna do something that's outside of clothing as well. Seamless wear, active wear, things of that nature. You use them. Crazy. How are you finding these red right? <laughs> So one of my favorite ways, there's a few different ways to do it. One of my favorite ways is to go over to a website that's called importyeti.com. So let me type that in really quick, importyeti.com. And now let's just say I wanted to look up Skims Manufacturer. I type in Skims, press enter, and then you can see Skims Body right here. So I click on Skims Body, and then now I can literally click Downloads and then download their complete suppliers list just by clicking this one button right here. Or I can scroll all the way down and then look at what you see right here, Eurotex Textil. <laughs> so I, that's how I was able to find Skims Manufacturer. And that's how I knew that that's one of their biggest suppliers right there. That's insane. So that's one way. I mean, there's plenty of other ways. I'll give you guys one more free way to do it. A lot of people don't know, but a lot of these companies, they have to showcase who they're using because they have like rules where they have to show they're not doing child labor and things of that nature. So let's just say you wanted to go to Target suppliers list. I can literally just go in Google and type in target suppliers list. And when I scroll down, I'm going to be able to see corporate website for target corporate.target.com. And I can see all of the factory lists that they're working with. So I can just click on that It downloads right to my computer. I open it up and now it's opening. And then I can see every single factory that target works with what they're making for them, where they're located. I can see everything about them. Anybody who's getting started, honestly, even if like you're beyond getting started, I think this is a lot of information. Yeah. There. Even if you're all super scaled up, you need to know where target's using. If you're a big brand and you want to get some better deals, this is who target you. I see you putting all this content out there gate kept information right. you really think this is the secret to help someone start to scale their business the way i look at it is like this this is the information that you needed just to empower yourself to be successful in general 
but you're gonna have to learn other skill sets too marketing advertising branding etc because if i have the same manufacturer as target target also spends a ton of money in advertising influencers etc so i don't think that it's gonna start you or scale you up just by knowing this information but it is going to give you a leg up to be competing at the highest level that's crazy yeah man justin you was also telling me about some kind of crazy story yeah you're giving out all of this information right. for free yeah on your instagram now some companies are coming at you so i never told this story before so i'm glad to share it with my brother so basically one day i was living on a plane and then i got a dm and the dm said hey, I'm about to ban your account. A big brand paid me to do it. And I was like, which brand? He was like, I'm not telling you, but it's three brands that came together and they all paid me tens of thousands of dollars to remove your account. Right. And I was like, bro, that's crazy. I didn't believe it. I thought he was trolling. I said, yeah, whatever, bro. Like, do what you got to do. Right when I send that message, my account got banned immediately. I never sent it. Like, him, like he saw the message and then pressed the button and my account was banned. And I was like, bro, this is crazy. So... I ended up getting on the phone with one of these big companies. I'm not gonna share their name right now because obviously, you know, we're still working on our relationship. <laughs> but, and then they were like, yeah, at corporate, everybody is mad at you because you're sharing this information that took our founders decades to figure out. And I kind of came from a place of, well, look, all of these new people in the, that are coming into the business, they need access to this information. So you're keeping this information from the kids that you say that you wanna see in the future and that you wanna see help, you wanna help them. I'm like, well, that doesn't necessarily come across in your actions. So my goal was simply give away all of this information to the kids that don't have access to computers or can't go fly to Pakistan and find a manufacturer so that they can utilize it. And then now I think that they understood that and we're kind of working on how we can kind of collaborate together to get this information out to more people. But it's crazy. They tried to, they tried to get me up out of there. <laughs> That's crazy. Yeah. All right, so where can people follow you at, Justin? Yeah, so my Instagram is Justin P. My TikTok is Ecom Justin P. And um, yeah, that's places. Sweet. So make sure y'all follow Justin if you want some more of this information. Also, click this video right here to see the very first video we ever did together. Yeah.